Hi everyone, my name is Elodie Ruel. Uh, I'm here at the Moore Park Open Day 2025 and I'm here to talk to you today about some simulation exercise we have done on trying to see what was the impact of uh, you know, the derogation and the reduction of nitrogen allowance in the last few years for derogation farm. So what we did is, you know, before in the past you could put 250 kg of nitrogen uh, on your farm and so that means that if you were stuck at 2.4 uh, co per hectare, you, could, you were actually growing enough grass to feed all your animals. But in the last few years, you had to reduce your fertilizer application to 225 kg of nitrogen per hectare, and you had to reduce it further then, or you might have to reduce it further in the future. And the consequences of this is that actually, uh, the farm at 2.5 co per hectare will not be self-sufficient anymore. So that means we'll have to bring more feed in the farm in the form of concentrate or you will have to balance to that lot of uh, chemical fertilizer application in terms of if you're bringing clover that might be able to compensate for. So what we look in those simulation also is that obviously that was very fairly positive for uh, water quality. There was less leaching, but there was a balance in terms of uh, you know how much grass you could grow on the farm. So if you want to more, find more about that, there is more information on the Chagas website and you can come to see me today at the Open Day.